episode is all about the dogs. American Indian dogs are smart and clever, with a high drive, and can be interesting to live with. They both trust me because I've earned that trust. If I ask them to do something that doesn't necessarily make sense to them, they'll try it anyway because they have faith in me. They believe me when I say it's okay, and I try very hard, as the one with the thumbs, to never do anything to break that trust, that faith. So here are the dogs, patiently waiting to play one of their favorite games. Ah, gotta wait. We have a jungle gym. Ready? All right, up steps. Down slide. Nope, oh, this slide. Down slide. Good boy. Good girl. Good job. Go again. I've taught my dogs the value of coming when called. It earns them the privilege of being off leash when appropriate and getting to have adventures without mom. And they come back cheerfully and enthusiastically when called. Good girl, come on. The darker dog, that Jay, dog, dog. is my mama's boy. Snuggler, he'd curl up inside my skin if he could. Good boy. Oh, here she comes. Loves to play fetch, but can be somewhat sensitive and reactive. Hi. <laughs> Adventures. Go on. Go on, sis. Go get your brother. He went down that way. Yeah, he went down there. Kane, blonde, is much more independently minded. But she's also very open to trying just about anything I ask of her. Dogs, yay, good job. I've taught my dogs useful skills like go find my keys or things like this. Mud puppy. Oh my god, look at you. You're filthy. <laughs> I can't reach that. That's too far away. Bring it here. Thank you. This is an Indian dog. It's going to be 12 in a few months. Oh, get it. Nice catch. Good save. <laughs> well done. Yeah. Oh, dirt. All the mud. <laughs> You're going to have to get hosed off before we leave, son. I call him brown dog. Now he's browner dog. You have socks of dirt. Look at you. I don't know you. Come on. Dirt dog. Yeah, you're filthy. God, you're fired. <laughs>